Ready? <laughs> oh, you have lipstick on your teeth now. <laughs> Don't make that face at me. You just looked at me with like this Christine. You know what? <laughs> so for my... Sorry. <laughs> Hey everyone! Today I've got my beautiful friend Holly here <laughs> and you guys probably all know who she is but if you don't then I will have her link below so you can check out her channel. She's very good at makeup. She makes me look like I just don't know oh what gosh. I'm doing. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Anyways. Okay so earlier today we were talking about our nails. Well actually I was actually telling her about my ghetto manicure that I had to redo and she was like wait what are you talking about? Do you do? And I was like yes. And she does the same thing. So basically, you guys, if you watch my videos, you know that I pretty much always have my nails done because I don't like it to be like all chipping and whatnot. <laughs> but sometimes you just don't have time to redo your nails. Like, well, actually, I probably did have time as lazy. <laughs> so, I think it has a lot to do with laziness because yeah. I'm really lazy. I had like a couple of chips on each nail and I really didn't feel like redoing it and I felt like we didn't have time to redo it. So I basically just painted over my nails and then did a top coat. But I feel like you can't tell and I do that... <laughs> so much in my videos because I just don't I, I, don't, I don't know I don't have a good excuse it just happens and then Christine said that she did the same thing I thought it was so funny because I was like oh my gosh I seriously just talked to my husband today about me doing this and I said this is so weird and ghetto of me I went over look it but you could tell with mine because I used two different reds I couldn't find my original red that I used so I used a different red thinking no one could tell you gotta do the top coat that's why that's why I offered you some top coat. That was a confession of ours, and we were like, hey, let's do a video where we're confessing some things. So, we're each gonna say three confessions, beauty confessions, put you on a spot. You're gonna go first. I'm gonna go first? Yes. Okay. So, my first beauty confession is that you guys know that I wash my hair every day, or I try to wash my hair every day, but sometimes I just get really lazy and I feel like it's really only the top part that gets dirty so a lot of times I'll just pin my hair back in like a ponytail or like with hair clips and then I'll just take shampoo in my my hand and then I'll just wash the top part of my hair just the top part? Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh I'll just wash the top part and then rinse it out cause like without getting the rest of your hair wet? Yeah. <laughs> oh my it's genius wait in the sink? Or yeah in the sink I just like put my whole head under and then just wash it. That's actually a really good idea because the top does get Christine's more oily. Christine's doing that now. I but am. But then you don't want to dry out the ends. Yeah. You know? Is this not going to get dirty really that much? I'm going to do that. <laughs> there we go. Cool. No, I really am going to do that. It's a good idea, right? That is a good idea. My first beauty confession is, well, it's kind of embarrassing in a way, but if my hairspray smells really good, like if I'm done curling my hair and you know I do my hairspray and everything, if it smells really good I'm like forget body wash, I mean body spray <laughs> and I'm like Psh! and I smell like full-on hairspray and that's my perfume for the day. What hairspray do you like? I like Pantene Pro-V actually. Really? Mm -hmm. Does it still smell like the old school Pantene mm -hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. that's good. How come the shampoo doesn't smell like that anymore? I don't know. <laughs> so my next beauty confession is more of just like a lazy thing I guess. So for me, if I'm getting ready to film and I'm always trying out new products, if the foundation that I have doesn't match or it happens to oxidize by the time I'm like ready to do my video, if it doesn't match, instead of redoing all my makeup, I'll just wear a shirt that comes up to my neck so, so that you can't compare it to anything else. So I mean, because my face and my neck are going to match, but sometimes, you know, your chest looks lighter, especially with the light on it. So I'll just either do that or like I'll throw in a necklace or something. Oh my gosh, like a chunky necklace or a turtleneck. That's the way to go. That's not why I'm wearing one today though. I'm just saying. <laughs> she matches perfectly today. My second confession is um, with mascara, I actually told her this one already. Yeah. I sometimes will put on mascara and I get an angled brush because I just don't want to grab the eyeliner or anything. I'll grab an angled brush and kind of get my mascara off and then just put it right down here. And oh, you didn't tell me that you took it off of your lashes to put onto your lash line. Well, I don't take it all off. Yeah, but like yeah, I go like this. Oh, I thought. You and then like, I like put it right here. Thought maybe you had like a smudge. Or, no, like, a no, and then I full on like put it right here. I feel like is that safe? And though? she said, you remember you asked me, is yeah. that safe? Or, and I was like, well, it does kind of burn. But is I still I, do it. I don't know. It's like a habit. No, don't, don't, don't do that one. Try it, guys. No, don't try, try it. Don't try it. Try it. Try it. All your viewers go blind. <laughs> or what if one of you guys actually do? If you do that, comment below. Or am I weird? You could just comment, Christine, you're weird. 
So my last confession is kind of boring, but I figured I'd mention it anyway. I'm actually not a frequent body wash buyer. I almost never buy body wash. I have one that I really like right now that smells amazing, but other than that, I normally just use shampoo because I feel like it's the same thing. Or you know how the Philosophy has their body wash and you can it says you can use it as bubble bath, body wash, or shampoo? I was like, clearly it's the same thing and why am I spending money on it? So I'll just use that yeah. for that. It gets you clean still. I do the same thing though. Do you Sometimes. feel like that's safe? I mean, it, it goes on your body anyway, but I don't know if there's like other things in shampoo. You know, like maybe body wash is more gentle. I don't know. I but you're putting shit. Yeah, maybe? it's like flowing down your body anyway. Maybe body washes are just a way to take your money. I'm. That's what I'm saying. Hmm. I honestly, I feel like body wash and shampoo are. I mean, obviously, I would choose shampoo over body wash. Like, I wouldn't use body wash in my hair. Yeah. But oh, I would, that's true. But I. Yeah. But you would use shampoo. shampoo on your body. So I feel like shampoo is like the better quality body wash. That's a good confession. You actually have good confessions like her confessions are like tips and mine are like I don't know if those are really tips I don't think that's well I'm gonna should be I'm gonna put my hair in a ponytail now and wash right here <laughs> just wash the top just use only shampoo as body wash even though there are some body washes that just smell really that good one. yeah yeah other than that I just I don't know I don't I feel it's unnecessary yeah so my last confession is I blow dry my eyelashes I don't use eyelash curlers you guys rarely see me using them. Do you ever see me using them? No. I don't think so. I, don't. I didn't even know I had one. Yeah, I, I don't <laughs> use them. I will seriously just walk into my restroom, turn on the blow dryer, and just start blow drying my eyelashes right after I put mascara on because I feel like it keeps them up and looking long. I don't know. It might just be in my head. Yeah, but you but have long eyelashes. I feel like my eye wouldn't work for me. I would just be blowing my eyeballs. <laughs> try it. I'm going to try it. And try if it. I want to get an eye infection, I'll be like, Christine's tips. I guess I could see how it would work. Because, like, a tip is to, like, blow dry your lash curler for a second and then, like, curl your eyelashes. So, same thing with, like, heat. Just, like, curling your hair. But Yeah. I mean, I don't burn my you eyeball. I just close like, your eye and do it. Or they're, it's open. No, they're open. I'm like, I look like a weirdo. I'm like... What does Larry think? He doesn't watch me do that. Oh. I wonder what he would think though. You should do a video. You should have it be like one eye non-blow dried, the other eye blow dried. That's true. And you can see. Future videos. Those were our confessions and um, we both actually just thought of one that... It's like a common we denominator have, yeah. confession. But I think it's a, a lot of people could confess to this too. Or like it's a beauty confession. I mean a beauty issue is it an issue of like a i don't know but i feel like we'll probably get a lot of people being like you shouldn't do that i know i heard it is bad but we actually feel better next day yeah but i don't do it all the time you don't yeah. do it all the time it's just like no. once in a while we sleep with our makeup on we do i don't do it intentionally i'll either fall asleep and you guys know that my sleep schedule is crazy so sometimes if i just get tired i'm like I'm just gonna let myself go to sleep i don't know i just feel like well, for me, my sleep schedule is always crazy, so if I get really tired, sometimes I'll just let myself fall asleep because if I wash my face or if I take a shower right then, I'm, like, so awake right when I get out. So I feel like I have to just let myself fall asleep with it. And honestly, I feel like my skin looks a lot nicer the next day. Like, I think because my skin needs more oil. <laughs> the festering makeup <laughs> fermenting on my face. Like, it does something good for my skin. Like, I'm sure if I wore it too many times, I slept with it too many times, it would be detrimental to my skin, but one night, I feel like, one night a month, or like one night every two months, I feel like my skin really does look better the next day. Yeah, and when I do it, seriously, all I do the next morning is just like, add a little bit of concealer, and I'm like, okay. Oh my god, you don't wash your face after? No! Okay, that's worse. I, yeah, I'm bad at that. Sometimes like, I'll do that to like, walk Evie if it's, because my sleep schedule is crazy, so sometimes I'll be up at 6 in the morning and be like, but take Evie for a walk. Full makeup from, I'm from filming a video. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Because I film late at night, like right now it's almost 11 o'clock. But, yeah, sometimes I'll go out like that and maybe I'll put a little powder on there, <laughs> blot it, something. <laughs> but I don't go my whole day without washing my face again. No, I add a, well, you know what, usually like late afternoon, like I'll just take all my makeup off. Oh, okay. And it's like, that's okay. I'm fine. So then that's okay. Yeah, but I do sleep with my makeup a lot and I need to not do that. I really yeah. don't because I know it's going to catch up to me one day. 
But I feel like every once in a while it's okay. Yeah. I just know a lot of people that do that. My mom sleeps in her makeup like every night mm -hmm. and she has no wrinkles. I mean, yeah. I'm not saying that's not going to cause you any wrinkles. Like, we're not telling you guys sleep with your don't, makeup. Don't do it. But yeah. we're just saying it happens. It's a we're confession. Human. Yeah. So don't feel bad if you do it. I used to lie to people and say, oh, I wash my makeup off every night. I just didn't. I don't think anyone ever asked me. <laughs> no one cares. I think they just assume that I do it every night. Most of the time I do. It's just every once in a while. I wake up really oily though. <laughs> Those were our confessions. And um, we hope you guys enjoyed this video. And now you know a little more about us and our little secrets. And yeah. If you guys have any beauty confessions you want to share, just let out to feel good. <laughs> I kind of feel a little better. Not really, but we can pretend. And uh, <laughs> yeah, just comment below. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And don't forget to subscribe to Holly's channel. It will bring you good luck. No, it won't. Yeah, it will. <laughs> okay. Okay. <I> will. <laughs> Bye. Bye.